thing about this law is I just think it assisted the person who killed my son to get away with murder. I think we have to change these laws so that people don't get away with murder. Because uh, from the trial, you've seen that my son wasn't doing anything wrong. Trayvon was just simply walking home. And he didn't have a weapon. He didn't have a gun. He had candy and a drink. So we need to take a look at that. He wasn't a suspect. He wasn't a burglar. He was just minding his own business going home. But it was somebody else's perception of him that changed everything, that caused his death. I don't think he would cause his own death. That doesn't make sense. So what I'm saying clearly, boycott if we must. Right now, we're asking you to talk to us. We're asking you to convene a legislature. But the boycott, and we know because, you know, quite frankly, let me be quite frank with you. We know black folks and other folks that are in impo impoverished areas, they work at some, in tourism. So before we take that step, we're saying we're giving you a chance to get this right. I know the senators and legislatures have asked to meet with the governor and to convene, but Rick Scott, I'm not sure why. He's offered no good reason on this God's earth why he would not just bring together legislature to talk. 